Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to Fresh Baked Disney, the best of Disney Baked Fresh Daily. I'm your host, David. That's my wife, Liz. Hi, hello. That's Ian. Yeah. Uh, it's lunchtime. We're starving. Starving. Yes. That sign right behind us is for food and wine. We're gonna go partake of some ghost pepper mac and cheese, Ooh, some kind of tacos. Yeah, yeah. There's the shrimp boil tacos. Shrimp boil. Yeah. Tacos. And uh, we'll find out what else. Let's let's go let's go get curious about Ooh, some food. Curious? Food and wine. Well, mostly food. We tried to do wine last last week. No, I mean, but we didn't do any of the wine or the beer. <laughs> Oh boy. Hi. It's much more intense than it was last week. Hi guys. I'm gonna move for a coat. Uh okay, we did nuts about cheese. Oh wait, is the uncork? Oh, no, that's the cheese board. The, uh, the, the pizza roll thing is, I think, are down there. Pizza yeah. roll is at the beer one, isn't it? It's at the beer one. All right, let's go there. By the way, I learned a hack. A, f a really cool. You can order any of the food yeah. at any one booth. Right. The downside to that too is a friend of mine discovered is you could buy one and sell them run out because somebody else oh, bought really? it at another booth and then yeah. you got, they got a refund. Because that well, didn't happen to a friend. I mean, of mine. that's only a. It happened during the New Year's friend of mine. They're like, oh uh, yeah, there's a problem with the system. We gotta come around. Yeah, right here. Uh, I'm gonna do that right here, actually. Are you gonna mobile order? Well, it's not a mobile order. So in case, yeah. Was it clear? Just take your receipt over there, and then they'll, because they, that's all they want is your receipt to show that yeah, you bought it. I guess that should be mark the individual item and not the whole Right. California craft brews. And Ian's got his sights on pepperoni pizza egg rolls. Well, I've got my eye on that cheese board that's being served at Uncork, California. Ian got himself. Some of them pizza Pe egg rolls. Pepperoni pizza egg rolls with marinara and pesto. I have I have a bad feeling about this. That's gonna be good and you're gonna want one? No. That you're not gonna enjoy. Go for it. Go for it, Ian. Nosh away, Ian. I might I wanna buy it. Oh, it's good. You like it? Yeah. Yeah. Does I mean does it taste like a pizza? Yeah, it's much What is that? Marinara, you got and some parmesan. And a pesto. Yeah. And, and, oh god, oh he's he went for both. That's a bold yeah. move. I mean, it's mozzarella and pepperoni and egg roll. Or mozzarella, that sounds, yeah. That sounds really, really good. Wow. He's gonna bite. Try to come here. Oh, it's delicious because it's just, you know, a little mini pizza. If you like pizza, you'll like this. Huh? It's like. I can upgrade to like a pizza, like a bagel pizza. What's better than a pizza? Like, oh. No, bagel bites. Oh, bagel bites, bites yeah. yeah. Is better though. Yeah. So if this could be like a find, some, find wow. somewhere in the park, just have this available year round. Woo! It's uh, you need like four more of those though, don't you? Yes. It's like eating taquitos. That's like make them make them bigger and then tilt. Yeah. Because yeah. I was telling you in Mad Adventureland and Magic Kingdom, there's a cart that has like egg rolls. Oh really? And there's a cheeseburger egg roll that Tim and Jen Tracker swear by it. Yeah. Because they're like, oh, well, yeah, the cheese cheeseburger egg roll came back. I'm like, man, <laughs> give us those. I am these. That's that was. And they're gone. Mm -hmm. How was the sauce? Middle. The uh, the um. What should we call it? Pesto? Yeah. Pesto, yeah. It's a pesto. It's yeah, good. you can't go wrong it's with pesto. pesto sauce. Yeah. Right. By the way, we tried to order the, the, the cheese board, but just like Ian was saying at the other at the other location that is, he wouldn't because he they're worried about things selling out. Yeah. Because then you have a scenario where both people pay, but only one person gets it. Right. So then you have to refund somebody. Yeah. And that becomes messy and annoying yeah. for the park to go the answer, I guess. Yeah. I think we wound up with the Point Reyes Blue. We sh I think maybe we should have gone for Fiscalini White now that I think about it. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah, we got a bunch of blue cheese, baby. I love, I mean, I love blue cheese. I don't know if you love blue cheese. I do, but that's a lot. The blue cheese is a strong cheese. Let's find a place to nosh on this. Trash. Yeah. So it's not so much a cheese plate as it is some cheese with other things. Crackers. So sorry. Oh, you're yeah. okay. I'm just gonna eat 
try it first by itself. Yeah. That's good blue cheese. Good blue cheese. All right. And you get some grapes, some candied uh, pecans. And I guess those are pineapple. pineapple. Are they dried? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And apricot. Mm -hmm. I'll that was good. Go wonderful together. That was good. Yeah. Here, try this. Try a pecan and the blue cheese. Wow, that is strong. Good. That's good, right? Very good. That's very very good. good. Yeah. Do you like blue cheese, Ian? I find with the flavors, it's a more of a, a mental thing where I think about the fact that it's visibly being molded in. I just say, like, I can't. It's not going to be like, if you were to put on it, I wasn't thinking about it. It's tasty because I don't mind the strong cheese. Yeah. But I see like the stuff in it and my brain says, no. <laughs> That's so funny. I never really thought of it that way. I'm going to try it with the... Uh, it's totally a psych just a psychological thing. <laughs> pineapple. Okay. Good with the pineapple? Mm -hmm. Maybe we try the pineapple. Mm. Because it has such a hard note, the pineapple, the sweetness of the pineapple oh, really, nice. really counters that nicely. I'm gonna try with apricot. <laughs> so good. I love apricot, mm. dry apricot. The texture of the apricot is it's dried. Yeah. It's very chewy. I would have preferred, I think I prefer the pineapple. Oh, you like the pineapple? Because it dissolves quicker. I see, I the see. I see, faster. I like the apricot. Once again, we disagree. Mm -hmm. Wanna this is my favorite thing that we've done so far. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow. This is better I than... I mean, it's very refreshing. Better than the cheese bowl. Better than the uh, pinwheel. Mm -hmm. Better than the that. mac and cheese, which we're about to get. The mac and cheese is yep. next for Ian. I would say go ahead and skip the, uh, don't worry about the wafers or whatever those crackers yeah, that they crackers, gave you, yeah. you can just pass on those. <laughs> just this with the fruit. plus this is amazing. There it is guys, ghost pepper mac and cheese. Wow. wow. It doesn't look like much. It looks really cheesy though. It does. Ooh, I felt the kick. There it is. Already, huh? Yeah. I like that. All right. Hey, hey how's it going? Hey. Hi. That's good. Yeah. Just like you remembered? I don't remember. I can't remember if it was this or there's always it was like a jalapeno maybe mac and I mean, cheese. That's like, true. There were there were always, bits in that other one. Yeah, there's always like one or two mac and cheeses at the festival. Yeah. Both, both are very creamy. This is the spicy one, I think. Yeah. I remember the I remember last year it had like those like actual chunks of of pepper in them. Oh yeah, like dried jalapeno. Yeah. I don't see that here. No, but it's good. Matter of fact, this that that dish last year inspired me to try to make one of those at home. It didn't go very well. But uh, well, it was very good. Yeah, I bet it. A quick bite from Ian's mac and cheese. It's not the same. No, actually, it's not. It's still very good though. It's it's a very hot. Yeah, that that kick gets is pretty quick. It's more chilly. Yep. It has a chili taste rather yeah. than the jalapeno. Yeah, it's got the uh, corn chip. Oh, yeah, oh, that's what it is. It's the Frito or something. Yeah. Yeah. It's essentially yeah. a box. <laughs> that kick gets you pretty quickly. And it's Woo! Pretty good. I'm still feeling it. But it's not a, oh my god, that's so hot! <laughs> I was going to say, it's not an overwhelming heat. And it's it is, like, it is it's for lightweights like us. It's that, it's that enjoyable slow burn. Not I feel like. Oh, like a. There's like a whole bag of hot flavored Cheetos. Golden Dreams. We've landed on some chicken masubi right now. It's got a whole bunch of other stuff in there. What is that stuff on top? Pineapple relish. That's pineapple relish and a better rice. Okay. And if not, it's, it's coated in it enough that you'll get the thing. You selling the custom things, then you say you make money and therefore... The pineapple relish, relish is really nice. Yeah. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> the, the rice looks a little sticky. Like it's, I mean, I like sticky rice. Yeah. I don't care for the chicken. Not crazy about the chicken. What about one of those things? These are, they're chili Orlando bites with salsa verde. All right. Nice. He's just gonna go, for, oh my God, he just. <laughs> Did you see that? He just went for it. Didn't we think that through by the fact that it's a chili full of chili juices? It's not overly spicy by any means. Right, right. It kind of exploded in my mouth a bit there. All right. Very good though. Liz, you get on that one. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, go for it. Okay, I'm gonna try it with you. Just make you don't try to eat it all in one bite. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. I mean, I'm gonna try to cut it in half. First of that. It is delicious though. It's good chili Orlando. 
So what is chili? Right? It's, it's just, just a chili. pepper. It just means it's, it's a stuffed oh, okay. pepper, yeah. Then this case has also been fried with the, with the breading, right? It's a stuffed pepper that's been with the breading and fried. Yeah. And the salsa berry really is great. That's very good. Go for it, George. No, you're good now. <laughs> you're not putting the whole thing in one bite, you're good. Well, I'm gonna leave it for you. Are you sure? Yeah. Alright. I don't normally go for green chili verde. I like salsa verde. I like but I'm, I'm digging it, yeah. I like both. Sure. Chicken masubi with the weird pineapple relish. Yep. <laughs> mm -hmm. So. Mm. No, it's this. It's the pineapple. It's not working for me. I don't know why. But what is that? That creamy on there. Yeah, it didn't say. I'm assuming that has to do with the masubi, but it didn't say on the sign. So. Oh. Okay. It's the chicken. Oh, Couple things. Chicken. It's way too much chicken. Yeah. Look at all that. I mean, fair, I appreciate that you got plenty of meat for your. Isn't money. that weird? Like my complaint is that it's too much now. I definitely prefer the chili Rileno. It was a very good chili Rileno. Yeah, it was. Yeah, that was really good. Mm. Throw it away. Liz? Woo! Watch it change before your eyes. Possibly. I've not heard about that, but we'll see if it does. Oh, let it dissolve. Look at it! It's like science! Look at that! It is. It's turning green. Oh. Yeah, the yellow is mixing in. Wow, God, God, the, the dissolving made it all fizzy. Look at that. Look how pretty it wow. is. That used to be a blue soda. Oh, it's smoking, too. You see that? A little bit. Oh, well, the carbonation was set off more strongly because of the... Science! Science! Oh, now drink it. Okay. Oh. By the way, paper straw. Yeah. Pa Parks are now doing the paper straw here as well. They've had it at Animal Kingdom for a few years. Yep. Now they brought it here. That's a smile. That's really good. Yeah. So what kind of soda is it? It's a Sprite. It okay. almost tastes like a Shirley Temple, but it's a pineapple. It's pineapple okay. candy, I think, or something. Is that what it is? Ah, uh, okay. With like a buttercream, like frosting. Yeah, this is buttercream right here. Yeah. Yeah. So what you do, you want to like lick it, and then have that in your mouth, and then take a sip. Okay. Like having a salt rim on a margarita. Pretty much. Yeah, that's a margarita. <laughs> but whipped cream and sugar, a soda instead. Wow, sweet. It's good. This brings back like memory, childhood memories. I feel like a child, yeah. yeah I totally feel like a child sure. drinking that. Cool. <laughs> what right, you need is one of those swirly, twisty straws that are shaped mm, like Mickey. Crazy straw, yeah. yeah. I loved it. <laughs> it's hard to get that stuff off the, off the rim. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good. That's really good. That is so far the highlight for me. Ah, uh, cheese, the cheese. I mean, yeah, it, it goes uh, cool. cheese lager soup, no, no, cheese board, and then that. Yeah, the blue cheese is number one for me. Uh, go figure. Huh? Uh -huh. All the food I've had today so far has been great. Yeah, except for this. Yeah. Well, you like this too. I didn't have it, so, you know. Try it. I thought you had that already. No. <laughs> no. No. I did not. Because like, you guys are jerks. You guys are chicken hogs. You guys said it wasn't good, so. <laughs> it's fine to me. All right. But, okay, but fine is not exactly a ringing endorsement. No. Like if I was if I was starving, it'd be like the best chicken ever. I just mean like there's nothing offensive about this palate taste. I want culinary delights, Ian. I want to have my socks taken off and put on the ground somewhere else while I'm eating my food. We we'll need some very advanced food and a more expensive restaurant. <laughs> <on this. laughs> eh, all right, he's not impressed by the chicken. I promise you. No, I don't think it's amazing, but it. But again, like I said, there's nothing offensive about it to me. Mike, it's tasty. I would have if there was a proper meal, like some roast, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I would. I mean, I'd rather have other things. But. <laughs> Are you going to take that with you? She has to leave. She's not going to get to try the tacos. It's okay. Just let me know how they are. They're going to be delicious. Your, yeah. your tongue is black. Is it really? Yeah. From the pickles. Yeah. yeah. Are you a witch? How can we tell if she's a witch? Does she float? Because she floats and she weighs as much as a duck. Right. We could build a bridge out of her. Oh no, that's how we tell if she's made of wood. Which also floats. 
This is tricky. I know. Gosh, science. We need more research to figure this out. What else floats? Ooh, I know. Very small rocks. Yes. Churches. No. Oh. Bravo, guys. I kind of was all over the place, but... I gotta go. Bye, honey. Bye, I love guys. you very much. I love you. I love you as the day is long. Mm -hmm. I don't want any more of that. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ian, Ian what's, a, what's a shrimp oil? I'm not entirely sure, but I've had it before. It's very, very, you know, Louisiana, New Orleans, Cajun kind of thing. It's tasty. Well, uh, but don't they normally? I mean, is, is that an odd way to make a shrimp by boiling it? Are they? Is that what that literally means? Are they boiling the shrimp? I don't know. I just know it's tasty and I'll have, hopefully later on at another point they'll have it in because they're still out right Well, now. that's why I asked the question because we went back twice to the uh, shrimp boil taco stand yeah. and both times they said, nope, sorry, we're sold out. No shrimp boil tacos for you. So we're going to do that, I guess, another time. Yeah, or I'll eat it later when they're gone yeah. and not tell them and try it and be like, wow, it's my first time. It's so good. <laughs> Ian. <laughs> Just be honest. All right. All right. Well, thanks for hanging out with us on our second Food & Wine Festival engagement. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, and if, if you could, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. It mean a lot. And uh, tomorrow, Ian, I think we're going to go to Tomorrowland. Tomorrow. Okay, that works. Wow, that's... Look at the synergy of our show. We're you, practicing synergy. You could be a parks manager. I could be a parks manager. Gosh. Hey, you know what? Let's make it a special event, uh, and we'll yes. make a t-shirt for it. But it'll only... But They'll only run for four hours, but, but you only need, for four but hours. Need, yes, like, at least six hours to even do half of it. <laughs> well, yeah, because the shirt line is going to be two hours long. Exactly, because right. it's exclusive. So I... <laughs> half the people there, we just resell it. Yeah, that's right. We're okay with that because we sold it, so we don't care. Well, yeah, t we'll limit it twenty per guest just yeah. to make sure that you know. Yeah, because I mean, once we've made our money, it's fine. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow, Fresh Bacon.